Baby. What? What'd you just tell me five seconds ago? I'm getting anxious. You're getting anxious? <laughs> like, For what? What are we doing today? It's so stupid because it's not actually the day, but it's just like, you know, it's like that feeling of like, oh my gosh, like it could happen. Yeah, like this is happening. Yeah. So what's going on? So we gotta leave here in about 15 minutes to go to my consultation. Uh -oh. So pretty much I am planning to get LASIK eye surgery. I'm really praying that I can get it. If you don't know what LASIK is, basically it's a procedure where you don't have to wear glasses anymore. For they contacts. basically like replace like these lenses in your actual eyeball to make you have hopefully 20-20 vision. Yeah, it's like you will get 20-20 vision. I'm sure there's cases where you haven't, but the likelihood of that happening is slim to none. Yeah. I might not be able to get it because I have a stigma in my right eye and I heard that if the stigmatism is too bad, you can't get it. But I also read that it also helps stigmatism, so we're gonna have to see. So hopefully they are even able to do the procedure. But you guys, the reason I have been really considering this and I actually pulled the trigger and I'm gonna do it is because I have been absolutely so sick and tired of wearing glasses and contacts. Anytime put my contacts in, they hurt me. They either get really fuzzy, I do my makeup and literally it like blurs it. I don't know what's been going on with them but they've been making me so mad and that's why I haven't been doing my makeup or getting ready as often because it's really hard for me to want to put my contacts in. It sucks. Like, it sucks. What, like I hate, I would hate that. I have 20-20 Vision. I'm happy Blessed. for that. But I see this girl the past almost seven years we've been dating, like daily, just has to worry about putting contacts in, take their contacts out, her. her contacts getting too dry, her contacts having to clean them overnight, getting daily, like spending all the money on glasses. I'm just and like, so sick of it and I was thinking like, I do not want to spend my whole wedding day worrying about my contacts. I know when I, I wake up at 7.30 in the morning to get my makeup and stuff yeah, done, right. all the way until freaking probably midnight. Ooh, I have to take care of lunch. Literally till midnight and I was like, I just want to have 20-20 vision. Like I want to be able to wake up on my wedding day and see and not have to worry about anything. Like Baby. I just don't want to be work. Like I when I walk down the aisle, I want to be able to see you and not have to be like blinking a lot. And not like your eyes watering. Or imagine waking up on your wedding morning and you're just like, like you rub your eyes and you're like, I can see. All right, let's get ready. Like for I want to be able to see you down the aisle without having my contact blurring up or just like anything. Like, I just want to be able to see. And just in general, like I just want to be able to wake up and not have to put my contacts in or wear my glasses. I am just so sick. Do of that. it. It would suck. I would hate that too. So. No, and the contacts have been really bugging me lately. I don't know what's been with it, but they have been really, really, really bugging me. And that's why I've been wearing my glasses. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I have not really been doing my makeup. It's also because I've been getting my face cleared up. Oh my gosh, guys, my acne, it's all just scarring now. And we're in the process of doing my micro needling and stuff. But that was another reason why I haven't been wearing makeup. But it's also because I haven't been wanting to put my contacts in and I don't really feel like doing my makeup and having my glasses on, it kind of kills the effect of my makeup. I've just been wearing my glasses a lot, and I'm, I'm sure you guys have noticed that. I'm just, I'm nervous because, like, that's the surgery is like big. Like, this is like your eyes we're talking about. Like, I don't know. It's, it's definitely gonna be a really scary procedure for me. But I heard it's only five minutes per eye. Dude, that's so. crazy. Cause if you think about it, they're literally performing surgery on your eyeball. Like, they're, they're. I'm not gonna go into detail. But either. they cut your eyeball uh, open, and I think they pull out like a lens or something and then they replace it with like a, a nice clear one or something. No, I don't think that's how it works. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Like they, they clean it up in there or something. Cause like your eye is good. Everyone's eyes are good. But it's the layer in front of your eye that I'm pretty sure, like that's what makes you have to have glasses. I'm just anxious, guys. Like this is like I have to be awake for this entire procedure. My eyes are literally open the whole. Like I don't know, it just freaks me out. Like I talked to Madeline about it because she's gotten it done, and she said it was the best thing she's ever done. So I am just really praying that everything goes good. I'm able to get it done, and I hope so too. when I do get it done, I hope that I see 2020 and I didn't go through all that for nothing. You so. know, even though it's a lot of money, you know how much money you're gonna save not having to buy contact and glasses. I know. And it's not even, it's just consultation. Imagine the day I fight when I actually get it done. Like, oh, so scary. I think it'd be fine. 
But we're literally about to head over there right now. We're gonna Stay bring you tuned. Guys with. We're gonna show you the insides, what they say, what they suggest from Mariah, if she could get it done. And if she can get it done, oh my gosh. I feel like it's gonna be like a weight lifted off your shoulder, but it's also gonna be a, a weight put on your shoulder because oh God, I, I already know you. She's gonna be, you're gonna be like tweaking. I already know, but that's my anxiety is the worst. We're gonna get through this. I went to the dentist's office yesterday and I was anxious waiting in the <laughs> like, and I, to get your teeth clean. Yeah. You're, you're anxious. I was anxious. Like, I. Mm. I'm gonna be stressed. But stay tuned. Baby, I'm praying for you. Wishing you luck. And we gotta leave. I know, we gotta leave here. We gotta go. Oh my god, I'm getting nervous. <sighs> Guys, we made it. I'm an anxious mess. I am freaking out. Like, I'm literally like shaking. And it's not even my surgery. Like, I'm not getting surgery today. I'm just getting a freaking consultation and I'm freaking out. But the place looks really nice. And we're about to go in. It's already 3 o'clock. Yeah, we we're late. So we actually have to get in there right now. And on top of that, we're almost out of gas. We're literally on E. So I don't even know if we're gonna be able to make it to a gas station. And we're a half hour away from home. Guys, wish me luck. Just wish everything luck. I'm just praying <laughs> I'll be able to get it done and this goes smoothly. It'll be good. I, I promise you, we'll get in there. I'm sure they'll have good things to say because I'm sure you're not the first person to freak out about no. something like this. No. Especially surgery oh. on your eye. Oh, I'm so nervous. <laughs> version of LASIK. Mm -hmm. um, it's uh, only a 60 degree incision and the laser itself creates the incision and a lenticule. So it kind of maps out the corneal tissue that needs to be removed. The surgeon goes in through that little pocket and extracts the lenticule kind of like a pillow out of a pillowcase. Um, the incision is much smaller so the recovery is a little bit faster in the sense that visually is the same 12-24 hours before things kind of start settling down. Starting the next day you can start working out, wearing makeup, uh, there is one week no water exposure to limit the chance of infection. So which one do you recommend? Like, I would do smile. Smile? Yeah. So I was going to do smile. I just couldn't because I ended up having a baby. So yeah. if oh, you're okay. pregnant or trying to become mm -hmm. pregnant, yeah. they recommend holding off um, just because during pregnancy and breastfeeding, the hormonal changes you go through can um, change your vision. Okay. Oh, did you see by any chance? Like, because people have said in the past she has a little like, what? Stigmatism? Yeah, have you? It occurs to stigmatism. Oh, cool. Um, yes, especially your amount of stigmatism. For the laser to create the incision in the lens, it 24 seconds. Oh, wow. And then Jeez. the surgeon does his portion within the minute. So you don't even feel it? No. How is like LASIK, is it like, do your eyes, I know they change over time, but like, have you seen LASIK like go throughout the, their whole life kind of being good or? Um, so Dr. People read Peter, it. she's actually our, you would see her next. Mm -hmm. um, she had LASIK 17 years ago and her distance vision, to correct her distance vision. Mm -hmm. It hasn't been, it hasn't changed. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Look at how happy she is. It's so, like I'm know, happy, but also really nervous. Y'all heard the conversation, but basically to sum it up, it looks like the we're gonna get LASIK. Wait, looks like we're gonna get LASIK. The room looks really nice and they said they record it. So oh yeah, Marvel Squad. So they're literally gonna record the surgery. That's so so you'll, cool. you'll get to see her getting LASIK. Ah! So we saw the operation room. I know you guys didn't see it, but we were walking around and like while she was showing us the bed, she said like there's massage chairs back there so awesome. to like ease them a little bit. And actually I should show off the car really quick because we're almost out oh. of gas. But Mariah can get LASIK and okay, we're literally gonna be recording the entire thing. I'll talk to them while you drive to get right. gas. So I'm officially getting the procedure done next month. I go in for pre-op next week, which is like you make sure everything looks good and everything. And I already scheduled my surgery. It's just so crazy because I don't know I get to see you I get to see clear I don't have to wear my contacts or glasses anymore like this is just so crazy to me like I can't believe that she have walked in and said I'm a candidate and I was like oh my god and then the smile one is so different than the other one yeah. which is like crazy that I was a candidate for that too like oh my gosh I can't believe it's happening I'm nervous but I'm also so excited like this is like gonna be so life-changing for me like not having to wake up and put my contacts in or my glasses on mm -hmm. like it is going to be the greatest feeling ever i'm nervous for like the actual day but they are super 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 nice in there and just looking at like the area and how where like the surgery room is i feel like i'm gonna be so comfortable it looked so relaxing didn't it like oh, just it that, looked, the vibe and the energy like it was I so nice it. in there like they said they just moved in that building like literally a year ago so the building was like brand new it was beautiful it was gorgeous in there oh my gosh guys i can't believe it's actually happening 
but I am so freaking excited. Less than a month. Less than a month. Or like in a month. Yeah. That's um, crazy. No, it's so freaking crazy. Mole and I were to take Valium though. They'll be fine. And they were taking Valium. It's like a pain. No, thing it's like a to, relaxation. To, yeah, to get to get you to relax. To settle. To be yeah. calm. Sorry. Honestly, I want to get on Valium. I'm like tweaking right now. I'm, I'm just trying to make it to the gas station. I see it, but when I tell you, we are on empty. Like, we are riding on empty model squad. So just let me, give me a second. I'm not even kidding. I feel like the car's going to die. Are you serious? Yes. There's a gas station right there, but look at it, look at it. It's not even built yeah, There's a yet. gas station right there. You're fine. You're going to be chilling. It's on E. We got time. The line is like this. You know this it takes a minute for e. it to... It's like this. It's fine. We're going to make it. But I see it. It's right there. <sighs> All right, but if we got to push the car, you better get your ass out there. Well, obviously I'm going to have to help, but gosh, I don't think I'm going to be a good candidate for that one. We made it to the gas station. We're all good. We are safe and sound. I knew we would. Bill's a tweaker over here and thinks we weren't going to make I wish, it. I Just thought... like when we ha went to Home Depot and there's a box for this skeleton he didn't think would fit oh in the car. Oh my God. That would have fit in the it car. It wouldn't fit in the car. Yes, it would have. I have put so much stuff in this car, right? More than you. And I looked at the box and I'm like, there's no way it's fitting in that car. Why would you chance buying it? Bringing it out to the car and then it not fitting what do you do then you just go back and return it yeah. why would you buy it in the first place i don't know think anyways smarter. no he's just he just doesn't think smart all right whatever anyways guys lasik is here it's coming i honestly was kind of hoping it wasn't gonna happen but at the same time like i wanted to happen. i think i would have been super devastated if she told me i wasn't a candidate i was waiting for that i'm like when is she gonna say like she should know probably by now yeah it's like what about she knew on the inside but she wasn't saying anything like oh this girl guys lost. and it's crazy because it's like bing bang boom like i'm getting this procedure done so quick like it's gonna come so fast i am just so excited i honestly wish i could just get it done tomorrow to repeat what she said she said the procedure is going to take like a minute yeah it's going to take 20 seconds for the laser and then another minute for him to fix your eye so back is this together. not even five minutes well maybe five minutes per eye but the actual surgery part is like the laser is like 25 seconds and then the guy putting the flap back and making everything good is like 40 seconds this to a minute. is crazy i can't even freaking believe it like i'm doing something this is huge you really this is a huge procedure like oh, I know. this is like like i don't know like being able to see is everything like that's just like it's and so important it's four thousand five hundred dollars which to some may sound like a lot but it is a lot in the sense of one payment but if you think about it like that four thousand five hundred i would be spending on my contacts and glasses she would be every spending year. five like each glasses is five hundred dollars and she gets a new pair every couple years because they go bad yeah and her contacts, contacts are like five hundred dollars a year right yeah, even, yeah for contacts so if you think about it in just three years you would have spent just as much as if you just got the procedure and the procedure the doctor that ha that got it done she said it's been good for 17 years and her eyes have been fine yeah it's crazy so this is like so cheap compared to how much you would be spending on i'm excited I, I think what that. i'm ultimately excited about is the fact that i don't have to worry about it on my wedding day and you're and saving time in the mornings you don't have to designate time to oh i need to take my contacts out oh my contacts are blurry oh i need to clean my contacts yeah, like I oh i need to go to the eye doctor up i can just wake up she going to the eye doctor's like 80 times i'm so sick of the eye doctor spending eye doctor. hours and hours of your day now yeah. i've never been to an eye doctor once babe now you're gonna be like that <sighs> Well, guys, thank you for tuning in. We will definitely be filming the day of the surgery and like the week of like repairing and recovering. She said this one, I can go right back to working out within a day. Well, yeah, but I think we should still. Get oh, well, it's gonna be a whole week and I'll wait and recover. Yeah, yeah, I probably yeah. won't go that Monday, but I'll probably go like Tuesday. Yeah. Or something. I'll go that week. Because your procedure's on a Friday? Yeah. Yeah. But oh my gosh, it's coming. That's, That's exciting. Happening. I'm really nervous though. It's coming up. Like, I hope I don't feel it. What if I feel it? You'll be good. She just said you won't. I know I won't You're feel it. You're taking like the volume. I'm sure they numb your. Your eyes that's what they said like they'll do all that you won't even feel it and it's so fast it's done by a laser it's so quick and precise like oh you'll God, be good i'm so nervous well but we're gonna do it we're gonna call together and i'm so happy i have you guys alongside with me and i'm kind of excited to see the video afterwards even though i really don't know if i want to watch it so stay tuned make sure to subscribe to our channel if you have not already first of all welcome to family second of all we literally are going to be showing the entire surgery you will see mariah laying down in the chair and getting it done that's crazy that the crazy. fact that we could film that is just insane and you could be in the room with me and I'm gonna be able to be in the room with her during I'm gonna surgery. Be able to be, you're gonna, oh my god, I'm so happy about that. that so you'll me have so me happy. in there. You'll have Marble Squad in there with you. That Everything makes me will be great. So freaking happy. Stay tuned for those videos. They're gonna be coming soon, like yeah. literally in a couple weeks. <laughs> Uh, All right, you guys, we're going to end the video right here. Yeah, I need to go put gas in the car because I still haven't yet. And we will see you guys in, in the, the next, next one. video. But, but until, until then, then, peace. Love, love you guys. guys.